Rotter Studios, recording studio and video editing with Steve Rotter. By the way, I'm Steve. Thank you for watching Rotter Studios. This channel is all about, in case you don't know already, video editing, audio production, photography, music, everything I love to do out of my studio here at Rotter Studios. I use Mac only. I used to use PCs for years. I built them, worked on them, etc. However, when I switched over to Mac in 2009, I could not be happier. I wanted to show you some editing that I have to do for one of my YouTube channels called RotterTube Reef. It's a, one of the many channels that I have on YouTube, and it deals with saltwater aquarium care that comes out uh, weekly on Saturdays. It's going to use a green screen, and there's a lot of different titles here that you know I could choose to open up the show. This is pretty cool. More of like a mystery type intro. But I'm going to choose this one because it's about saltwater aquarium care. We've got the girls in front of the green screen. Green screen is going to be uh, used as, like many of you may know, made famous by Lucasfilm. It's how you make things fly. Basically, anything that's filmed in front of a green screen, or any color for that matter, the background will be transparent. So basically, the editing software is blind to the color green. So it's going to be see-through. So what we can do is get footage that we want to have behind the girls. It could be anything you want. And in this case, I'm going to get some saltwater aquarium footage. Okay, so this audio sounds pretty good, but what we're going to do is we're going to go here and I'm going to boost the audio just a little bit. So we're going to go down here to audio. So what I'm going to do is select the com compressor and I'm going to drop it on the timeline. Then I'm going to go down and select uh, Sonic Maximizer just to kind of emphasize the EQs, bring up the low end a little bit. And then I'm going to go up to here to audio going to select my presets that I've created that sound the best for YouTube. It's going to raise their levels. Now it sounds a little better. You have to figure out what size and shape aquarium you would like to maintain. It sounds better. It's more full now. See? I'm going to increase this by 2 dB. First, you have to figure out what size... Maybe a little more. 2 more dB making it 4. That's perfect. First, you have to figure out what size... And over here, you want to make sure you don't peek out past zero. Zero dB is the flat line. If it gets any higher into the red, it might distort. You don't want that. It's difficult to move several hundred pounds of water, coral, and fish, even a few inches. Make sure that direct sunlight will... If it peaks in the red once in a while, that's okay. You just don't want it to be solid, blasted the whole time. Because keep in mind, your viewers will be able to, of course, raise and lower the volume on their laptops or their iPhones or whatever they're going to be watching this on, on YouTube. So, peaking above a little bit is okay. I'm going to just leave it like that. All right. So now let's get to our opener. I wanted to choose the water one since this is a saltwater aquarium channel. Okay. So we're going to drag this to the beginning. It says underwater. We're going to change that. We're going to call it the name of the show. Rotter Tube Reef. This will be called Saltwater Aquarium Care. See how cool that looks. And then I've got an announcer somewhere. Here we go. I'm going to take this, drag it to the beginning. To Tube Reef, Saltwater Aquarium Care with Steve Rotter. Now, I'm not appearing in this one, only the girls are, so I'm going to get rid of where it says with Steve Rotter. So I just. Steve Rotter. Steve Rotter. So right here is where she says with. So that's where I'm going to move this back to, get rid of all of that. Perfect. Rotter Tube Reef, Saltwater Aquarium Care. Perfect. Welcome to Rotter Tube Reef. Let's bring the girls down to just 2 dB. Let's raise the announcer. 
So we want the same sound quality for the announcer as with the girls. Yep. We can make a, a smooth transition, you know. That might work. Welcome to Rotter Two Brief Saltwater Aquarium Care. See, isn't that cool? In this video series, we'll talk. Now, once we've got these videos here, we're going to go to the effects, keying, and we're going to go to keyer. <laughs> See? Why are the girls in our house? They're not in our house, it just looks like it. Yeah, it just looks like yep. it. Yep. Yeah. yeah, but it doesn't. Do it again. No, 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 I'm not doing that again. <laughs> yes, you are. In this video series, we will talk to you about what you need to start a care. In this video series, we will talk to you about what you need to start a saltwater. We will take you through the steps in a series of videos. First, you have to figure out what size and shape aquarium you would like to maintain. Let's look for pictures of saltwater aquariums, sizes and shapes. Aquarium you would like to maintain. So we'll just do a little transform. So this will just come up, <clears throat> right? It'll put a little crossfade on this guy. Perfect what size and shape aquarium you would like to maintain and where you would like to place your new aquarium. That's nice. Whoa, look at that. That's damn awesome. Drag it under the timeline, there we go tank where it can be easily seen to place the tank where it can you'll probably want to place perfect transform it put it up here make it smaller so it's not touching her drag it up that's good now what we'll do is add some music That will be pretty nice. Little blues jam, but silently in the background. Or else you won't hear the girls. Welcome to Rotter Two Reef Saltwater Aquarium. See how nice that sounds. Let's lower it by uh, 10 dB. See what it sounds like. Welcome to Rotter Tube Reef Saltwater Aquarium Care. In this video series, we will talk to you about what you need to start a saltwater aquarium. If you're thinking of getting into the saltwater aquarium hobby, you've come to the right place for help. We will take you through the steps in a series of videos. First, you have to figure out what size and shape aquarium you would like to maintain and where you would like to place your new aquarium. It's difficult to move several hundred pounds of water, coral, and fish, even a few inches. Make sure that direct sunlight will not shine on it, especially in the hot summer months. Not only will the water temperature rise, but it will promote algae growth. Hey everyone, Shoe Nice again. Well, basically, I just want to say thank you for viewing Rotter Tube Reef. Thank ya. <laughs> Hopefully that made sense. Any comments or questions, please let me know. Don't forget to check out the video description for more information on this video and links to my other channels. Hope you enjoyed this, and thank you very much for watching and subscribing. Click the subscribe button so you receive updates on when new videos come out. Thanks again. 
Thanks for watching. Please click the subscribe button for more videos.